Aloha mai kako. This will be a very brief presentation on keia, kena, and kela. They're the first words that we usually learn in Olalo Hawaii, um, but they're very important, they're foundational. So it's very important that we get this because it's a little bit different from the concepts that we have in English. Um, but if we can get this down, that'll be Romai Kai because some people get a little bit confused by reading the book. So we have three words Keia, Kena, and Kela. The first, easiest one to remember, Keia. There is no Okina when you write out Keia, but the native speakers pronounce it as there is an Okina there. Uh, so they pronounce it Keia. Keia, um, later on we'll learn the word Eia. Eia means here is something. Eia, Eia kapeni. This is, here is the pen. Um, Eia is something near the speaker. Um, like uh, this. This pen. Keia peni. So Eia is always going to be in your space as a speaker. Then we have a little bit different concept from English. In English, we have that, this and that. In Hawaiian, we have this, that, and that. The difference between the first that and the second that is that first that is near someone, the second that is far. So, kena, the first that, we'll just call it the first that, is something near a listener. Um, you can kind of remember it with this nu over here, this n. N stands for nay. Kind of here, near. N Nay, near. Near who? And it's always going to be near the listener. The person listening, um, the second person in the conversation. So, if I'm the first person in the conversation, I'm talking, um, I'll say, ah, keia penny. Oh, nani keia penny. Oh, this pen is nice. And let's say I have a friend. My friend's name is Randy Jackson. Randy Jackson is going to be my friend to show us the difference between keia and kena. So I would say, oh, nani keia penny, because it's in my space. And let's just kind of make like my partner Randy Jackson is a little bit farther. He'll go, oh, nani kena penny, because I'm listening to Randy Jackson. It's in my space, it's not in the speaker's space, if he's speaking. It's going to be near the listener. He goes, oh, nani ke na penny. And I'll say, I, nani ke ia penny. My space, Randy Jackson's space. If I put this into Randy Jackson's space, I would say, oh, hey, Randy Jackson, nani ke na penny. And Randy Jackson will go, I. Nani no ke ia penny. So two different people, two different spaces, the same pen, but depending on whose space it is, it gets different markers. Ke ia if I'm speaking, and if it's near me, and Randy Jackson is speaking, ke na, because I'm listening to him, it's near the listener. If I put this in Randy Jackson's space, I'll say, oh, nani ke na penny, because it's close to Randy Jackson, and Randy Jackson is listening to me. And if Randy Jackson says a uh, reply, so go, I nani ke ia penny, because it's in Randy Jackson's space and he's speaking. My kai, my kai. <clears throat> All right, and now we have the last one, kela. The la stands for fa. Ho, la for la, rhymes with fa. Ho, the baga stay fa. Um, so this is a that, but this that is far away from the listener, far away from the speaker. It's in nobody's space. So I can say, who nani ke ia penny? And Randy Jackson will say, who nani ke, ke na penny? But if I throw the penny over there, there's a pen all the way over there. I will go. Oh, nani ke na pen, a ke la penny. Hey, Randy Jackson. And Randy Jackson will go, I nani ke la penny. 
for both of us, it's Kela because the pen is all the way on the other side of the room. None of us can reach it. If it's out of hand's reach, kind of farther away, uh, nani Kela penny. It's farther away. For both of us, Kela. The little, for a little cheat sheet that will help you with your Ha'avina, the response for Kela, if I go Heaha Kela, what is that far away? The reply would be Kela. Oh, He Penny Kela. If I say Heaha Keia, Heaha Keia, which we'll learn in the Heaha um, PowerPoint, the response will be He Penny Kena. If you have a partner, He Penny Kena. Heaha Keia, He Penny Kena. Kena is a response to Keia. And if someone asks you, Heaha Kena, what is that near you? The response would be, He Penny Keia. He Penny Keia. Keia and Kena are partners. Kela is far away. He's one outcast. Kela gets the response of Kela. Uh, I hope that cleared it up a little bit from the squares in your book. Um, it's easier to see when there's a three dimensional space. Uh, but we will, right over here, we're going to have a little story to help us along this Keia, Kena, and Kela. So feel free to watch the story, replay the story. It'll kind of draw out a space, maybe better than I just showed with me and Randall Jackson. So we have this one Kanaka. Heha Keia. Heha Keia. He's asking, what is this? What is this? What is this in his hand? Yeah, It's in his face. Ah, yeah, yeah. And his friend comes along. He manapua kena. He manapua kena. If we can see, keia was replied to with kena. Kena, the proper response to keia. Yeah, keia. He manapua kena because it's in his face. He's listening. The manapua is close to him. Kena, near the listener. And for near. He manapua ke ia. Because it's still in his space. He manapua ke ia. This is one manapua. And she says, I ono ke na manapua. I ono ke na manapua. Yeah, that manapua near you is delicious. I ono. And now he asks, Heaha kena. For him, kena is not the manapua that was in his hand. Kena um, would be referring to this thing in whoever he's talking to his hand. Heaha kena. That thing near the listener. Heaha kena. To which the woman replies, He musu bi ke ia. He musu bi ke ia. If kena is in the question, the response would be ke ia. He ha kena, he musu bi ke ia. Her ke ia is this guy's kena. Mai he mai kena musu bi. Again, doesn't change. Still kena because it's close to the listener. Mai he mai kena musu bi. Where is that musu bi that's near you from? My here, my. My kela kalaka. My kela kalaka. Because the baga stay far away from both of them. My kela kalaka. To which would the response be for kela? It would be kela. Kela is one outcast. Kela just responds to himself. Kela gets a kela response. Who? Ono ka ai my kela kalaka. Her kela is also his kela. It's far away from both of them, near none of them. Who? Ono ka ai my kela kalaka. My kai, my kai. So if there is any ni now, uh, feel free to shoot me an email. My email can be found in the Lao Lima. Uh, and I hope you guys found this presentation helpful. If there is anything that's still unclear about the, power, the PowerPoint, the presentation, 
how you use ke ia, ke na, ke la. Just send it to me in an email and I'll get back to you as fast as I can. Mahalo, ikanana, anamai. Thanks for watching. Ahui ho.